Good morning. While looking for an interesting photo that I could use in this activity, I came across with this one that really caught my attention. Aside from having a heart to any TRRM related issues, I felt that I really need to share this so that others will know the importance of contingency planning and any disaster prevention and preparedness activities. This is Umaira Sanchez and she was only 13 years old. The first time I saw this photo, I thought that she was a slave being punished by her master. With a rope tied to her wrist, I also thought that it was to prevent her from escaping. This photo actually created quite a controversy because those who've seen it questioned the photographer's inaction towards the girl's situation. But behind this photo lies a very heartbreaking reality. Sanchez's life couldn't be saved. It was on November 13, 1985, when a highly active volcano in Colombia erupted, melting glaciers and sending gushes of mud and debris into the villagers' houses. Sanchez and her family were at home when that fast-moving lahar literally wiped their town from the map. Imagine being in that situation and you couldn't do anything because you were unprepared. You might be asking why were people taking pictures of her instead of helping her and getting her out of that brutally cold water. Many actually tried to rescue her, but every time they do, the level of water around her would raise a little higher, so they had to stop. It was soon discovered that Umaira's legs were being held down by a brick door and clutched in the arms of her dead aunt. The rescuers then revealed that the only chance to save her was to amputate her legs. Unfortunately, they didn't have the needed medical supplies. Sanchez, on the other hand, despite knowing the distressing situation that she was in, tried to talk and joke around with the workers and rescuers. She even sang so and reflected on her situation. 60 hours after being in that situation, Sanchez said her final goodbye to her mother and asked the rescuers to let her rest. Sanchez became an international symbol of the 23,000 who lost their lives in the tragedy. Her positivity even in the face of her death and the photographer's heart-rending photo delivered a message to the world. Colombia now has a directorate for disaster prevention and preparedness to help prevent future unnecessary disasters like this. But would you rather experience this before doing so? It's our call.